Hello, I'm Edward and welcome to WindowsReport.com. In this video, I will show you how to fix the NetHelp MSG 2182 error. The NetHelp MSG 2182 error appears due to issues with Background Intelligent Transfer Service that assists update downloads from Microsoft servers. To find the solution for it, you can try run the dedicated built-in Windows troubleshooter. But if the problem with bit service leads to NetHelp MSG 2182 error, reset the store cache. You can also try to restart the Windows Update tool in order to fix this annoying issue. For a more detailed explanation and even more solutions, please check the article in the description below. The first solution to this problem could be running the Windows Update Troubleshooter. You can do that by pressing the Start button in the lower left corner and writing Settings. Then click Settings. In the Settings tab, you can just select Update and Security. Then you can click the Troubleshoot from the left pane. Select Windows Update and click Run the Troubleshooter to launch it. Then you can go through the Windows Update Troubleshooter for potential fixes. The Windows Update Troubleshooter can fix numerous update issues. Another solution that can work could be running the Bits Troubleshooter. To access the Bits Troubleshooter, all you have to do is clicking the Start button in the lower left corner, then writing Control Panel. Click Control Panel. Afterwards, in the Control Panel window, just click Troubleshooting. Then click View All on the left of the window to open the list of troubleshooters. Here you can find Background Intelligent Transfer Service as a troubleshooter and all you have to do is click it. Go on Advanced and select Apply Repairs Automatically option and then press the Next button. The Background Intelligent Transfer Service troubleshooter is one that can fix bits issues which is what some users need to do to resolve the NetHelp MSG 2182 error. Another solution could be running a system file checker scan. Press the start button in the lower left corner and type in CMD. Then right click on command prompt and run as administrator. Before initiating the SFC scan, enter the following command in the command prompt and press enter to fix Windows 10 image corruptions. DISM slash online slash cleanup line image slash restore health. Then enter SFC slash scan now and press enter to run the system file checker scan, which might take about half an hour or longer. Lastly, restart the desktop or laptop if the SFC scan does repair system files. This is because the system file checker scans can fix bits errors and corrupted system files. It is another great Windows built-in troubleshooting tool you can use for various issues. You can also try restarting the Windows Update. Click the Start button in the lower left corner, then type CMD. Then right-click CMD and run it as an administrator. Afterwards, input the following commands and press Enter after entering each one to turn off Windows Update. Net stop wow serve net stop crypt svc net stop bit and net stop msi server next input the below command ran and press enter c double dot slash windows slash software distribution space software distribution dot old that command will rename software distribution to software distribution dot old. Then enter the next command and press enter. Ran c double dot slash windows slash system 32 slash cat root 2 space cat root 2 dot old. And to restart the windows update, enter the commands below separately net start wow serve then net stop crypt svc net stop bit and lastly net stop msi server restarting windows update might fix that service and the net help msg 2182 error 
And lastly, you can also try resetting the Microsoft Store cache. Click on the Start button in the lower left corner and type in CMD. Then right click the command prompt and run as administrator. In the command prompt window, just type wsreset.exe and press enter. Then restart Windows after clearing the MS Store cache. This resolution is more specifically for users who need to fix the NetHelp MSG 2182 error for MS Store. Sign out of the MS Store before clearing is cache. The resolutions above have fixed the NetHelp MSG 2182 error for some users. So they are the most probable fixes for this issue. For more information and details, please check the article in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.